Message for tail on headquarters, Washington, D.C. Enter now. You can't go forward with this. This thing has been ill-conceived from day one. It's already in progress. We don't know enough about their systems. It could easily spiral out of control. No, the virus has been restricted to the Washington headquarters only. You don't know that, Augur. Virus engaged. Upload sequence commencing. None of us understands how Talon technology really works. And that building is a living organism. And most importantly, we're putting innocent people at risk. Jonathan, what do you hope to accomplish by this? Talons have technological superiority, right? So the only way to gain an advantage is to understand their weaknesses. But by shutting down a building? Yes, exactly. If this works, we gain an insight into the operation of their systems, and we need that information. At what cost? Virus uploaded. Transmission commencing. <sighs> Augur? <laughs> You're gonna be impossible to live with now. Do you have a fallback position if this thing gets out of control? There's a counter virus. It should be effective. Should? Maybe it's time you stopped thinking about the Talons and their systems. Maybe it's time you started thinking about us. Virus upload complete. Three years ago they came, forever altering the future of humanity. William Boone's life has been destroyed. A man caught between two worlds, assigned protector to the Companions, undercover agent for the Liberation. An alien-implanted cyber-virus expands his mind, controlling a bioengineered weapon of unprecedented power. William Boom searches for the truth. I expected more of you. I can say the same thing about you. Your relationship with Da'an is weakening your effectiveness. Sad part is, you don't even see it. It's about knowledge. I'm learning more every day. And knowledge is the weapon we need to save ourselves, not a virus. Talons will only respect us if they see our strength, just like every other enemy we've ever had to face before. And that is what this mission is about. Respect. I need to go to Washington to alert them before the virus spreads. You're gonna have to get there on your own. I won't ask again. Are you prepared to accept the consequences of this action? Yes, I am. Yeah, go. Boone, Don's pilot is ill. We require the services of Captain Marquette for an obligation in San Francisco. When? Immediately. Security will meet you there. But have you identified the problems with this transmission? This just occurred. We have commenced system diagnostics. I will accompany Captain Marquette to Washington to help with the systems analysis. We'll be there in five. Boone, that's not necessary. I don't agree. A systems malfunction could cripple vital services to the Talons. All efforts must be made to solve this problem. Very well. Don't ever doubt that I'll do whatever is necessary to support this movement. So will I. Is there a problem, Captain? Not at all, Da'an. Prepare for liftoff.
Have you experienced communication problems like the one we face today? No. It appears the communications is the only system affected. I confirm that. No, wait. Let me pull up the security grid. Making the jump to interdimensional. Problem with the security grid indicates a system-wide malfunction. The only option is a total shutdown. Well, we can't compromise Don's security, Boone. It's the only way to isolate the problem. U.S. Shuttle 2. Don, we are experiencing a system-wide malfunction at this facility. It appears that the Talon Central Processor has been invaded. Can you provide any guidance? Can you maintain control of this craft, Captain? The controls are sluggish. Don, are you injured? We are experiencing control system malfunctions. Captain Marquette is compensating. Please, concentrate on the problem at hand, Agent Sandoval. Check the security grid again. Shuttle US-2, this is Companion Headquarters, Ottawa. We read your distress situation. Ottawa, why are you responding? Companion Headquarters in Washington is disabled. Your communication was automatically routed to the closest Companion facility. Communication systems are corrupt. Terminate all contact immediately. Do not contact any other facility. Ottawa, respond. What is your concern with the communication systems, Captain Marquette? The problems they're having at the Washington headquarters may be affecting the shuttle system. It may be dangerous to expose other companion systems to this contamination. Yes, that reasoning is consistent. Systems failure is endangering the people in this facility. I'll check the central processor. Coordinate the evac. Agent Lassiter, emergency procedures are in effect for this facility. Execute total evacuation. Immediately, sir. I hope you're satisfied. The systems are running amok. Well, the counter virus was coupled with the virus that Lily injected. You have to activate it with a command of the data stream. Uh, doubtful. The data stream is already in a state of severe deterioration. Well, the data stream must be corrupted. You'll have to activate it from the central processor. Communication with Lily was severed. She may have been able to contact another Talon headquarters. Confirm it. What the hell is it, Hogger? The plan did not anticipate contact with any other companion facilities. Well, are you telling me the contact with the shuttle could cause the virus to infect other Talon facilities? It's conceivable, yes. Get back to me when you know how to activate the counter virus auger. Central processor is still operating. I wasn't able to locate the contaminant. Yeah, go. Evacuation complete, Commander. I recommend you and Agent Sandoval depart immediately. We're on our way. can't reach the shuttle. We must confirm Don's status. Are you injured, sir? No. What is Don's location? Unknown, sir. 
The companion tracking systems are down. Conventional radar cannot track craft in interdimensional flight. What is the building status? The systems are down, but there's something strange going on. Elaborate. The systems are down, but the building isn't dead. The structure itself seems to have sealed itself shut. Contact Companion Headquarters in Ottawa. You can locate Da'an through their tracking system. Ottawa is experiencing the same problems as we are, sir. A failing Talon system will trigger a distress signal to all other Companion sites. Try Mexico City. We tried them all, sir. No success. In Washington, the Companion Headquarters remains completely disabled, sealed off from the outside world. Similar system-wide shutdowns have been reported at Talon facilities in Europe, India, and across South America. The crisis appears to be worldwide in extent, but it is believed to have started at the Talon's American headquarters. There's still no word on the whereabouts of the downed shuttle carrying the American companion, Da'an, and his pilot, United States Marine Captain Lily Marquette. Captain Marquette's locator may have been damaged in the crash. Recalibrate the tolerances to pick up a weaker signal and rescan every square mile. I'm reworking the counter-virus algorithm. Well, get on it. I can't afford any casualties. I can't... I can't move. I'm pinned. You have... Three bruised ribs, and your internal bleeding will cause your death if you do not receive medical attention shortly. Are you injured? No, I am not. You are the priority. The reactor's gonna blow! Once the process starts, it's only a matter of seconds. You'll never get me out of here. You gotta go. Go. Just go! Two workers in Sydney, Australia, are on life support following injuries sustained during the shutdown of that nation's companion headquarters. And in Tel Aviv, a Talon research hospital had to be evacuated when their systems also failed. Authorities now fear that all human facilities that interface with companion systems are at risk of infection and shutdown. United Nations Chief Sonia Alandez has convened an emergency meeting of the Security Council to deal with the crisis. And American President Daniel Thompson is expected to address the nation later in the day. Get away! Go! There's no time! I will not do that. virus is spreading to Talon systems all over the world. It started in this building. Our answers are here. My concern's for Da'an, Boone. I can't help Da'an if I'm trapped in here. Now would be the time to leave. in need of immediate medical attention. And you must return to the Synod to help with the crisis. You can, you can send help back for me. You are as aware as I that if I leave you now, you will die. And you must understand that I will not do this. Yet, you persist in suggesting it. Why? You're too exposed out here. It's my duty to protect you. Would you not act exactly as I if the situation was reversed? Yeah, yes, I, I would. As would any other soldier. As would all Talons. You required support for your ribs to slow the internal bleeding. The building is reading us as alien, like the virus. How ironic that we're the aliens. Agent Lasseter, have you located Da'an? No, sir. 
I'm gonna try for the south exit. That part of the facility is farthest from the central processor. The effects of the energy release might be lightest there. We need to attack the virus here. Our best chance is to fight it together. You don't even know how to fight it, Boone. Our only hope is to get to Da'an. We don't even know if Da'an is still alive. I have gathered fuel and food. You've been pretty busy. It is imperative that we move toward our destination as soon as possible. Believe me, I know it. Where did you learn to do that? From your reference material. I know a little shortcut. I've got her. It's a low-level signal, but it's definitely her. She's in the Appalachians, approximately 80 miles southwest of Knoxville. What's the topography like? It's heavily wooded. Damn. It's tough to get a chopper in there. You'd have to sit down here and walk to the site. But can you determine if she survived the crash? I'm afraid not. The signal isn't moving. All right, Captain. You know your orders. Move out. Do you have fire on your planet? Yes, we do. Although, unlike you, we do not use it for the preparation of food. Only for heat? We have more sophisticated methods to generate the temperatures required for our comfort. We use fire only for the aesthetic pleasure. It's the best reason to build a fire. <laughs> I have studied the native peoples of this land. They used herbs and berries to heal their sick and wounded. I have endeavored to do the same. <laughs> Thank you. not bad. <laughs> Turn it up. I assure you my administration is doing everything in its power to protect our citizenry. In the absence of our American companion Da'a, we are working closely with the Talon representative to the United Nations, Za'or, to restore the companion system to safety and working order. I join with other world leaders in issuing an appeal for calm. God willing, we will resolve this situation quickly and effectively with the help of the Companions. Mute. That's his advice. Stay calm. Augur. He has no idea what he's up against. The Talon research facilities will be the next to implode, and some systems are directly tied into our satellite grid. You know what I'm talking about, Doors. Weapons, guidance, systems. Augur, this is not helping. You have to keep your focus. My focus? Yes, your focus. People are going to die here, and it's only a matter of time, Jonathan, and I'm the one responsible. Show me how you're trying to stop the virus. Don't you understand what I'm telling you? I can't stop it. I've tried. Show me. What's wrong? The Talon commonality is reaching out for me. I have never felt their presence so strongly, yet been so removed from them. Can you feel their presence on a psychic level? We are all present for each other on a multitude of levels. We are never alone in our thoughts. We're so different. For many of us, escaping to the solitude of our thoughts is our most precious time. Each of us could cut ourselves off from the common thoughts if we so chose. But none of us do. Are you afraid to face your own thoughts alone? I suppose that we are. A 
rescue party is on their way. We must send a signal. I, uh, I don't think that would be wise, Don. We should see who they are first. How would our enemies know where to locate us? I'm, uh, I'm not saying that there are enemies, but in our present condition, we, we would be too vulnerable. Captain Marquette's locator signal. Now remember, she'll have to act as if she's protecting Da'an. We must respond as if she's the enemy. What about the alien? Captain Marquette is our priority. Do whatever is necessary to protect her. Is the virus spreading? Yes, sir. We were just informed that Lisbon and Singapore are the latest to be infected. 46 companion headquarters worldwide have also suffered damage. Any casualties? Several injuries, no deaths. Most of the sites were evacuated in anticipation of infection. There is another problem, though, sir. Go. As you know, many of the Companion headquarters are housed in complexes where human facilities share technology with the Companions. Are the human systems being affected? In Santiago, Companion headquarters adjoins the airport. Air traffic control went down, and we had three near misses before the airport was closed. Keep me informed. <clears throat> The Talon systems are like living organisms. They cause the virus to mutate, making any other counter virus totally ineffective. I'm working blind here. Try looking at the problem differently. If you can't activate your own countermeasures, you'll have to use the Talon building itself to fight the virus. How? How? That is what you are going to tell me. I mean, the building must have its own defensive systems. It does. I designed the virus to bypass them. It is possible. If I could reroute the energy flows, maybe they'll purge the virus. Good. Get on it. And like the politician said, stay calm. This fire hasn't been out 20 minutes. She can't be that far. The good news is, Marquette's still alive. She's about 300 yards, southwest. Keep your weapons up. Back, back, right there. Boone! Yeah? Are you okay? Where are you with this thing? Well, Dor suggested a new approach. I think it could work. But you still need to get down to the central processor. Well, I'll let you know when I get there. What happened? The south exit was completely sealed. We need to get down to the central processor. Why? I think we need to tap into the system's controls. It may be the only place to attack the virus. You don't know these systems, Boone. You know this building better than I do. What's my best shot at getting down to the central processor in one piece? The most direct route is through the arterial conduits, and they weren't designed for humans, Boone. How do I get in? The closest access point is at the entrance to Da'an's living quarters. Do you recognize these men? These men are liberation. You have to go on without me. We can't risk your capture. Or yours. Oh. We must move on. We go on my signal. Now.
Let's keep moving. We're almost at the central processor. Come on. Let's move. Come on. Come on. Come on. The system is cleansing itself. The processor access point is just on the other side of this intersection. Poor and Taiwan have suffered blackouts, leaving millions of people without power. In London, New York, and Tokyo, the stock exchanges have suspended trading for 48 hours in hope of limiting the economic damage of the Taiwan crisis. Senegal. 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 Try it. Can you continue? That won't be an issue. Did you reach the central processor? Yeah, what have you got? Well, like all living organisms, the building has a purge function. It sends massive surges of energy through the conduits. My program masked the virus, so the processor doesn't know where it's hidden. Now, if we bombard the virus with one of the energy surges, it should disable it. Great, how? Okay. Well, you'll need to do it manually. The energy surges originate in the security system, and the virus is located in the communication system. So you're saying if I connect the security system to the communication system, the processor should recognize the virus and bombard it? Come on, I'm running out of time here. I designed the virus to move to other systems if it was threatened. So I'll just bombard them all? No, no. If you send energy pulse into a system that does not contain the virus, the failsafe mechanism will kick in. Uh, what'll happen then? Well, let's just say, Boone, that you won't need to consult me on your wardrobe anymore. Thanks. <coughs> You've been a big help. Who was that? Lassiter. Still no word on Don. Tend to her injuries. Captain Marquette is in need of immediate attention. My welfare is secondary. Please, escort her out of this environment. We are trained medics. She'll receive the care she needs. And your plans for me? We're not in the business of creating martyrs. Why are you here? No, I will ask the questions. Why are you here? We have explained our purpose on your planet many times. No, all you've done is lied since the day you arrived on Earth. I have not lied. Do you deny that you're implanting humans with CVIs? No. 
I make no such denial. But I will acknowledge that there are medical procedures that we are undertaking, which some humans may find objectionable. Then again, I'll ask you why. I truly do not believe that it is in the best interest of humanity or the Talons to reveal to you that which you cannot comprehend. You know we'll never accept that as an answer. And neither will the rest of the world. The rest of your world is not asking the question. What do you intend to do? Those bolts of energy that almost toasted us are the processor's purge function. Why hasn't it killed the virus? It can't find it. <laughs> and you can? I can certainly try. My diagnostics showed an abnormality in the shuttle's communication system. And that is my best candidate. Those energy pulses are coming at regular intervals. We need to redirect them into this port. But we've only got the time between the pulses to make the connection. We'll pull at the same time and switch the ports. All right. We'll go on my signal on three. One, two, three. We got to do better than that. Yeah, I think so. doesn't work? You and I won't have to worry about it. Good work, Boom. Wide-scale panic has swept across the world in the wake of the Talon shutdown, which has now spread to a vast array of human systems. In Moscow alone, police estimate a crowd of over half a million has converged on that city's companion headquarters in fear and confusion. In Washington, President Thompson issued yet another plea for calm as he visited a Comtech lab where researchers had been injured. How is she? She's banged up. Boone's finished the rerouting. I don't have a backup. And if the rerouting doesn't work? I don't know. Not responding. It's also showing no signs of attacking the building. Oh. It didn't work. Oh. I sense a great tragedy is about to befall the Earth.
size of the companionship defies description. Reports are coming in from every city. It's as if the whole world can see it. And all I can think is, thank God they came in peace. Thank God for the companions. This is the power we possess. Yet we utilize it only to save humanity from destruction. Why? Perhaps that is a question you and your colleagues should seek to answer. In my time on your planet, I have yet to share such closeness with a human as I have with you. That goes both ways. I would like for us to reach a new level. How? We Talons have the ability to direct all of our energy to a certain part of our body. Everything that defines us is included in that energy. Your feelings? Your emotions? Yes. My hands are the conduit. Let us touch.